The Statistical Institute of Belize today finally released initial figures of the data collected during the 2022 census. Surprisingly, the population for Belize in 2022 stood at 397,483, well below the 2022 estimate of 441,471. This is significant as explained by Ministry of Economic Development, CEO Dr. Osman Martinez, who said that the country's population affects international funding. The country's benefit is based on population. Okay, so that's one point. Two is like debt to GDP. Now, so the IMF will use it. What is the debt to GDP, the income per capita, uh, inequality? Also, it helps us to look at the population in terms of how many young people are there that needs to be educated. So, for example, one of the most expensive investments and one of those that have the biggest return is education. And it's expensive because from the time of a child's uh, started to go into school to the time they graduate with a bachelor's degree or a master's, it's almost 20 to 22 years of investments that a nation will have to do. So those are some of the examples that we can look at. Another example would be with MCC. For example, we are looking at um, Millennium, Challenge Corporation. Millennium Challenge Corporation, which we are heading to, to Washington uh, DC next week to close that negotiation, which will be at $250 million. But again, it's tied it's a grant money, and that is tied again into um, into the country's population because other countries that are bigger, they have gotten more money. So in this case, uh, it do help. And some um, times, uh, for example, like the Korean Economic Development Fund, which their eligibility is based on X amount of a uh, people that should be on a country. And so because Belize's population was be, uh, below that threshold, Actually, the president of Korea was the one who approved it directly. So, but there are so many criteria where population and all the macroeconomic indicators play a major role. According to the CIV, our population grew by 75,000 people since the 20, 2010, that is, census, or by 23.3%. As to the male-female breakdown, the percentage of males is 49.2%, versus 50.8% for women.